For anyone that hasn't heard the news, popular streamer Etika passed away recently after he took his own life from dealing with a long battle of mental illness that greatly affected him up until the end. Just like anybody, this is a person that had people who loved him and those that didn't. But regardless of how anyone felt towards him, I think it's time for people to understand that this was a man that was dealing with his own demons inside, just like any one of us. You know, it's easy to forget, but no matter how famous a person may be, they're still human at the end of the day. People are gonna make mistakes, and can, in time, learn to grow from those mistakes. Etika's final video was the ultimate reflection of such growth, and that, even now after his death, should not be ignored. He wanted to apologize for everything. I'm sorry, yo. I'm sorry I betrayed your trust. I'm sorry I pushed you all away. I apologize. Well, I just want to say, Etika, I think we all owe you an apology. Some of us more so than others. I believe everyone deserves to live a happy and prosperous life. And I believe things would have gone a lot better for you now if just someone could have made it to you that day and show you this is also not worth giving up on. And he was going to get the help that he needed this time. You've been an inspiration and made an impact on me and a lot of people's lives. And that'll definitely continue on. I think in the end, there's a lot we could do to learn from situations like these. Reach out to that family member or friend you haven't spoken to in a while and check up on them. Let's try to be a little kinder to each other because you never know what someone else is going through. But most importantly, the first step should always be to be kinder to yourself. We're all gonna have to go someday, but maybe with just a little effort we can push to make it a good run for ourselves and others while we enjoy what we have here with the time we have. So in the end, thanks again Etika. I'm sad I never got to meet you face to face, but even just through a screen you was able to touch my heart, man. And I'm going to carry that on with me as I, myself, strive to grow to be a better person. So for now and forevermore, Joe Come Boys for life. Rest easy, my dude.